everyone, it's Jenna Massey from Clean Fitness. Today's workout is a back and bicep focused workout. So we'll work on that, that and then finish off with some cardio core. You will get some core in a lot of these exercises, but we'll finish off and hopefully complete this under an hour. So I'll basically be using dumbbells. I will be using my barbell, but you don't need the barbell. And I do have chin-ups on the list of exercises to do. If you don't have a chin-up bar, just substitute something where you're doing something reverse grip. So reverse grip row would work. Um, you can do something with the bands. Just make it, make it happen so you're focusing on the back and the biceps. So we're gonna start with a Tabata warm-up. We're gonna do squats into a curl. So you're gonna come down and then curl and then come up. Um, or you can come down, curl, and then pull up. So whichever way works for you, you'll get your biceps warmed up and then dead rows. So hinging, rowing, and then pulling up and finishing off that deadlift. So four minutes, I'm gonna use 25s for the dead row, since we're just warming up. If I feel like I can move up to 30s, I will. And then I'm gonna use 15s for the bicep curls. We're gonna start in eight seconds. I'll start with the curls and the squats. So coming down, curling, and then squeezing up. So nothing crazy right now. I'm trying to just focus on getting areas of your body warmed up. So squeezing and then pulling up. All right, front rows. I'm sorry, dead rows. So hinge, come down on that deadlift. Squeeze those shoulder blades and then pull up. So make sure your body and head good alignment, spinal alignment, and then squeezing up. So obviously with these exercises, you're also getting your lower body warmed up. Squeeze up. So you sit back into those heels. All right, back to your biceps. You can change your kind of curl, you can do a hammer curl if you want. Alternating that way, getting your forearms warmed up. Try to keep your chest up. And press up. And two dead rows. down, nice stretch, squeezing, and then pulling up. All right, we're happy there. Back to our biceps. I'm gonna do hammer this time. Come down, hammer, and then press up. So slow and controlled, okay? Don't rush. This is just sort of the warm up. We're tight and breathe. A lot ahead of us <laughs> to do today. Take each circuit at a time. All right, one more time through. Sticking with the hammers. Back in his heels. So I'm using 15s. I don't know if I said that. I'll we'll probably use 15s for a lot of the biceps stuff today. Right. Last time, last 20 seconds. So it comes down, squeeze. All right, 
we're done that. So we're gonna move on. We're gonna start with an imam. <laughs> so this will be three exercises, five reps of each of them, and doing it within a minute. So we're gonna do five rounds. So five minutes, not too crazy. And we're gonna use the same weights for, the, for all three exercises. So we'll do five deadlifts and do five bent rows, and then reverse grip, we'll do push-ups in that reverse grip style. I'll give you a little more biceps. So I'm gonna try my 30s for these. Um, let's see. Let's see how I do. I have 25s nearby in case I need them. Still kind of warming up and getting ready. <laughs> All right, so we'll start five seconds and five deadlifts, five bent rows, five reverse grip push ups starting in five seconds, five rounds, grab your beats, and lift down for five. One, two, three, four, five, coming down the line. One, two, three, four, and five. Down for your push up. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, we got a nice 30 second rest. So let your heart rate come down and prepare yourself for round two. Not sure if I just like rushed through it because I wasn't sure how long it was going to take. So I will focus more on that muscle mind connection second round. But your heart rate's up. I think it's from those push ups. All right, five deadlifts. One, two, three, four. And five, bent rows, hinging and squeezing. One, two, three, four, and five. Reverse grip, push up. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, 20 seconds. All right, a little more focus on muscle movement, so we have three more rounds. I think 30s feel fine. No complaints there, ready, here we go. Round three. One, two, three, four, Five bent rows. One, two, three, four, and five. Reverse grip push up. And go to line one. Don't drop it. Two, three, four, and five. All right, two more rounds. We got this, and then we got a nice giant set coming up. That'll be three exercises, three times. We're going in 10 seconds for round four. I'm grabbing my weights. Make sure I've run. <laughs> There's push ups. One, two, three, four, and five. That rows. One, two, three, four, and five. Reverse grip on the push-ups. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, one more round. I think you should be fully warmed up. <laughs> Seconds, last round, last minute. Grabbing my weights. One, 
two, three, feel that nice stretch, four, and five, back rows, one, two, three, four, and five, come on up, reverse, grip, push up, one, two, three, four, and five. All right, we're done our first EMOM. There's another one coming up later. So, let your heart come down, and we're gonna talk about what's next. So, we have a giant set coming up, three exercises. So, you're gonna do eight single arm rows. I'm gonna use a 40, I'm gonna lean, do my eight rows of each arm. And then I'm gonna do reverse grip into a good morning. So probably use my 25s. If not, I'm gonna drop to my 21s with my power blocks. The hard part is like holding that um, rows because you're gonna hold and then you're gonna finish with that good morning and then go back down, that's one rep. So I think I'm gonna set these up just in case I need to drop. And then the third exercise is just chin-ups. Five of them, so only five, so not too bad. And chin-ups, we'll hit a little bit of biceps, so we'll keep these here. Just three rounds, so I'm only at 15. Chin-ups, single one around, here we go. I'm gonna use 40. And I'm gonna lean. Eight reps, bring me all the way in. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, and eight. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, come on to our reverse grip row and good mornings. Reverse grip, coming down, up, oh, I'm using the 21, so let's see how that goes. One, coming back down, two, three, four, which I can feel my biceps, so this actually might be the perfect weight. Six. Seven, eight, nine, last one, and I got those chin ups, so your biceps are getting hit twice. And so we'll stress them before we hit the chin ups. Try and get full range if you can on the chin ups. First grip. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. Kind of hard to do this back to back, okay? So do your best. Round one, done. Maybe two more. And I'm actually going to move up on my single arm rows. I'm going to use a 45 total bell right here. So I'm going to use that. And then you guys. My biceps <laughs> feel it. So stretch them. Here we go. Eight reps. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, a little more challenging, and that's what we want. Okay. 
on to those rows and good mornings for 10.
We're gonna do 16 hairless slams. I'm gonna use my 35 for that. So one rotation is one rep. And then we're gonna do plank rows. So I have 25 for those. 10 of them. Just gotta make sure my weight's ready. So I'll put that over here. Then we have isolated bicep curls. So I'll use 15s. One's gonna be isolated, 90 degrees. While you curl for four, hold, four, hold, four, four. So each side gets eight reps. And then we're gonna finish off with a burpee deadlift. I'm gonna use my barbell. So actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my weights out of the way and just grab one and leave them. Make sure I'll do the plank rows this way. So I'm gonna use my barbell for the 10 barbell on burpee deadlifts. All right, every minute we switch. I'm gonna start with my hairless slams for 16. We're going in five seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, squeeze the core, eight, nine, Ten, six more, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. All right, we got 23 seconds. The nice thing, we're all doing everything three times. <laughs> so, plank rows next. 10 on each arm, so it's one total. Hopefully, we can get that in, with that, in that minute. Going a few seconds. I'm in my plank. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, and one. 23 seconds. All right, we got those isolated bicep curls for each plug and holding 90 degrees. We got 15 seconds. Move your 15s. Going in five seconds. Hold one up and curl for four. One, two, three, and four. Then hold this one. The other one goes one, two, three, and four. Curl the other one. One, two, three, and four. Curl the other one. One, two, three, and four. All right, we got a nice break before we go into our deadlifts, burpee deadlifts. So I'm going to use my barbell. It's set at 80. Bringing it down, getting ready, getting your space to do that burpee. Doing a push up on the bar. We got 10. Back push up, pop it in, and down left. If I have time, I actually might add weight. Two, three, four, Five seconds. 
grab it. Bring your low slams. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten more. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, and 16. All right, 20 seconds. We do a plank raise. That definitely took a much in the weight. <laughs> Going in 10 seconds, 10 plank rows. This is round two. Remember, you only need three rounds. Going in three. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19 and 20. All right, a little bit of a break. Really need it. <laughs> so, now, blast of curls are next. So, at least we have two exercises where the rest periods are not too bad. So, it helps us get through that burpee deadlift. We're going in five seconds. Isolation curls. One's up, curl the other one. Two, three, and four, halfway down. One, two, three, and four, bring it down, halfway there. One, two, three, and four, halfway. Last one, one, two, three, and four. Good job, guys. All right, we have 20 seconds before we do this burpee. So I'm gonna try and be a little more dynamic with my push-ups. Oh, 10 seconds, take a break. Breathe. Let's finish up round two. Four seconds we go. One. Two, three, four, it's too much, leave out the push up. Five, six, seven. Eight, two more. Nine. Ten. We got ten seconds. Whew. Hello, for the last time. Grab my weight. Sixteen reps. One. One. Halfway there. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. And sixteen. All right, nice little break. I'm gonna move this over here for later. We got this plank rows in fifteen seconds. Going in 10. In five, 
three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten more, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fighting those hips, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Bicep right. curls coming up. And less than 20. Grabbing my weights, I have 10 seconds. Allowing my heart to come down. Three seconds, hold one up and curl. One, two, three. Four, one, two, three, and four. One more on each. One, squeeze it. Don't throw it. Two, three, and four. Last four. And the good news is we can use a whole minute to do the hoods <laughs> burpees. Three, and four. And slow down. Last minute is coming up. I know it says two, but it's the last minute. <laughs> Grabbing that barbell. This is it, going eight seconds. Three seconds. One, but you do want to get it under a minute. <laughs> Nine, last one. And ten. All right. Oh, we're done. That e mom. It's the last e mom. I like how come down. <laughs> I'm breathing heavy. So. Oh, as we're doing that, I'll explain what's next. We have a time set. So once again, three exercises. We're going to do this three times through. We're going to do back flies, so 10 back flies. So hinging again. And bringing the weights in, so not close to your body, but out a little bit more. So I'm going to try and do, I'm going to do 20 ones on that, and then switching my weights for the bicep curl with the, actually, I'm gonna use 12 with this one, because you're gonna, you're gonna curl, and then you're gonna wrist twist. We'll do 10 of them, and then you're gonna do a get up into a hammer for five. So that will just be you coming down into that full pullover. You're gonna stand up, and you're gonna take the weight, and you're just gonna hammer curl. I'm gonna try and use my 35. There's only five of these, so. We'll start with our back flies. I'm gonna use, 20 ones, 10 reps, make sure you're hinging, one, squeeze it back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, all right, I'm going to do 12s, See how this works. <laughs> it's not something I do on a normal basis, but you're good to get your wrists and your forearms working. So you're gonna come up, twist, and then down. 
we got 10 total. So up, twist, twist, and back down. So up, twist, three. Not, not feeling too heavy, so I'm gonna take my time. Maybe go up to 15s in the next round. Four. Focus on that negative though. So bringing that weight down. Five. Fighting gravity. Six. Seven. Maybe I'll stick to 12. <laughs> I actually feel good. Eight. I don't want to be throwing my weights. We'll see. Nine. And ten. All right, we have our get up for five. That little hammer curl. So grab my weight, and then all the way back into a full pullover. Come up into a squat, hammer curl. All the way down. I want you to do this with control. You can use a little bit of momentum to get up. Two. that full pullover. You're up. Three. I got 35s. So feels fine. Feels heavy. Four. Last one. And five. All right. Back to our back flies for round. Take a deep breath. Mentally prepare. Ten of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Curls with a twist. Here we go. Curl up, twist, twist, and then down. Two, three, fire on the biceps. Get a good wrist action here. Two, four. Regular curls at this bottom of this. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's do the twelve. Feel good. All right, get up with a hammer, especially up with these. <laughs> More pump and forearms too. All right, press. grab that weight, come all the way down for that pullover. So with control, you're going to come up and curl. One, two, Three, two more. Four, last one. This round. And five. All right. Press the cover. Towel off. We have one more round. And then a Tabata and a core cardio finisher. Which those two together, 10 minutes, okay? So you got this. Starting with our back flies for 10. Deep breath, hinge. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and pull up. And we have our curls. Here we go. 
off the twist. So curl up, twist, twist, and down. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Squeeze it up. Don't use momentum. Five. Halfway there. Six. Seven. Eight. Squeeze it. Nine. Last one.
already. And make sure your shoulders are above the hands. Squeezing those abs, working them. And then we're gonna go back around in our reverse plank, round two.